Hey YouTube, I went thrift store shopping yesterday. I love my VHS and board games. Let's see what I got. So it's best to go vertical in this video because the tapes are vertical. So for 50, this first batch I got for 50 cents at World Serve. Uh, Ghost, great classic movie. I have a beat up copy. Um, now I've got a better copy on the case. I found this sealed package of All Quiet, All Quiet on the Western Front. Four time Academy Award winner from 1930. Uh, so I've never seen this one and I won't see this copy, but one day I'd like to see the movie. I love old war movies um, Jumanji fantastic movie from my childhood just loved it. I think I saw this one in the theater um, I Found a pretty good copy. It's got a little bit of a tear on the side, but um, Pretty good overall. Anyways, I'm super excited to watch that one again What year is it? Uh, it was brand new. No What? year is it? Uh, 1995, remember? 95. Rest in peace, Robin Williams. Pretty in Pink. I've heard the, the name before, but I've never seen this the movie. It's got... I don't know that guy is, but I think that guy was in Fast Times at Ridgemont High. But anyway, I don't know anything about it. Um, but apparently, I think it's an 80s classic. I was uh, born in 82, so I was a kid in the 80s, and so I only cared about kid stuff. The Jewel of the Nile, uh, I've heard the name again as well, but I've never seen it. But this box art, guys, I mean, you got jeeps, you got horses, you got swords and fighter jets and Danny DeVito in a genie hat and Kirk Douglas flying along holding Danny DeVito. That thing's pretty crazy. Anyways, I'm excited about that. Why Do Fools Fall in Love, Halle Berry, v Vivica Thought Fox. Uh, I really don't know anything about this movie. Um, I don't know. We'll see. Five for 50 cents, what's wrong, right? Uh, Angel Eyes, Jennifer Lopez. Two thumbs up, Cisco and Ebert and Roper. I don't know anything about it. Um, that guy was on The Passion of the Christ, which is an amazing movie and he's a good actor. Um, J-Lo is hit or miss, but um, I don't know, we'll see. It'll be on the chick flick section. <laughs> uh, Ernest goes to camp. Who doesn't love Ernest? Who grew up in the 80s, 90s, and didn't like Ernest? Oh my gosh, I'm, I mean, I have a copy of this, but this box is, is much, much, much better than my old box. So I will have to watch this one again. It's a great movie. Show your kids that movie. Ernest goes to camp, Ernest goes to jail. Ernest, I think, what is it, gets scared. Anything Ernest is amazing. <laughs> Where are you now, Ernest? Uh, bringing down the house. I saw this one uh, at a premiere, thanks to my stepdad. Um, he got, got us tickets. Um, and it was pretty awesome in the premiere. I don't know if it was awesome because of the crowd. Uh, if you've ever been to a premiere, you know what I'm talking about. There's a certain energy that's there. Uh, oh, Canadian. Um, but yeah, uh, it was funny back then. We'll see if it's funny again. Slapshot. Amazingly enough, as a comedy fan, I've never seen this movie. I've heard it's a good one. Um, now this is my second case. It's kind of, gotta get that sticker off somehow. Um, but yeah, it, I like to have another case of things. So that was it for World Serve. Next I went to Goodwill, and at Goodwill I got, for 50 cents, anything with a red tag is half off. So AI, I love this movie, fantastic movie. It, um, I, I often rate things in my head about how many times I laugh, if it's a comedy, how many times I cry. Uh, so this one I think I cried like four or five times, and it was just, such an amazing movie, directed by Steven Spielberg, uh, Haley Joe Osment, um, Jude Law. It's just J Haley Joe Osment is is just unbelievable. Your heart will break. It's a great movie. In a distant future, in an age of intelligent machines, he is the first robotic child programmed to love and coexist as a member of a family. This is a tale of humanity and a journey to find his place among humans and machines. I'm a boy. You are a real boy. And we 
least as good as I've ever made one. Uh, another 50 cents. Well, this whole stock will be 50 cents. Deep end of the ocean. I know nothing about it. Reasonable condition. Uh, Shawshank Redemption. Fantastic movie. If you haven't seen it, obviously, what a, you're either like really, really young or been living under a rock. Um, ah, Bonnie and Clyde. I saw that this one this year with a different uh, cover, a different tape, and it's just, it's become one of my faves. It's just, I don't know, it's it's such a cool style. If you respect it for what it was, like the, 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 the directing and just, you know, the different effects and just, it was a good, good movie. Horse Whisperer. My mom took us to this uh, as a family. It was her day to choose, I guess, and all I do is remember sleeping halfway through it. As an adult, I don't know if I'll like it. I do know that I'll probably won't watch it anytime soon. But, um, so School and Eber gave it two thumbs up. They gave everything two thumbs up. Honeymoon in Vegas. Um, I've heard of the name of it. I haven't heard, I haven't watched the movie. So, should be good. Um, who doesn't like Nick Cage, right? How the West was fun. I have never seen a Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen uh, movie or anything like that, but hey, for 50 cents, fantastic condition on the clamshell. Um, maybe one of the kids will like it. Love me my Bible books, my Bible movies. Uh, amazing Bible series, the amazing book. So. I don't know if there's an amazing trumpet or an amazing rock or I don't know what, but it seems a little redundant, but take a look at the good book. Love it. I found this foreign copy uh, sealed of uh, Finding Nemo. Um, it, it says original version English, but I think that may be Arabic. I don't know. I'm, I know nothing about anything other than like English. <laughs> Um, but it says it was manufactured in the UK. I just don't know. Well, it's got a lot of English on it, but then some of that. So, I don't know. I don't know what that means. Found Barbie, the princess and the pauper. Good condition clamshell. Never, obviously never seen it. I don't have any sisters. And, uh, but it'll be good for the little girls. The Treehouse Gang, a buttercream gang adventure. Never heard of it, and that's why I bought it. It's feature films for families. Salt Lake City, Utah. Oh, maybe it's a Marvin movie. Well, either way, it'll be a neat collection. Neat addition to the collection. Strawberry Shortcake. Uh, I've never seen anything Strawberry Shortcake, but obviously I've heard the name and seen the toys. And so, very good condition clamshell. 50 cents. Spider-Man, The Sins of the Father. I haven't seen this. I probably will want to see this. Um, I, it's a total 80 minute running time. So, I don't know. Could be good. These ones, I got for a buck. The reason, because, well, I have no idea who Wayne and Shuster are, but it's got a cool opening case like that. Uh, biography, um, Oh, looks like they were in the military. Um, they've got Boston Bruins, Toronto Maple Leaf hockey jerseys, and so they got something to do, as well as on the back, it shows them holding a Canadian flag. So, very curious and curiouser. Canadian, oh, there we go. Canadian Broadcasting Corporation, distributed exclusively in Canada by Astro Video. All rights reserved. Ooh, you Americans are going to have a hard time getting a hold of Wayne and Shuster. <laughs> um, you're missing out. <laughs> Recess. Who doesn't love Recess? Who grew up in the 90s and 80, in the nineties and didn't love Recess? i would never seen the movie, though, and so I just saw them on TV, and so I'm happy about this. Um, oh, one well, little question to the comment section. Was Recess like a Canadian thing, or... Um, I don't know, or are Canadian, we're Americans into that as well. But I paid a buck for that because I've never seen it. Also, this is definitely worth a buck. Transformers the movie, never seen it. Super stoked about it. Excellent condition. Very good condition on the clamshell. So I will probably watch this one pretty soon. Very stoked. 
The Earth is a battleground. Megatron must be stopped, no matter the cost. <laughs> And I found for a buck a sealed copy of Cinderella. Cinderella. Love the movie. I am always have to add a sealed edition to my Disney collection. Who doesn't like that, right? So I went to Valley Village and the lady said, I asked the lady, how much are video, uh, VHSs? And she said, two bucks. Okay, so they had a bunch of them, but when I can pay 50 cents elsewhere for good quality stuff, why well, pay more, right? So I only bought two videos, but when I got to the till, it rang up and she scanned it and it was only a dollar each. So I could have bought a couple more, but I chose The Cell because my fiance loves this movie. I enjoyed it way back when um, and we would love to see it again. Uh, it's about a lady who gets lost in the mind of a very bad feller who, who kidnapped a young girl and and Jennifer Lopez has to travel through the crazy man's mind to save the young girl. Will she do it? The cell. His mind is her prison. Uh, and Beast Wars. Beasties Escape. I can't remember which is which but I think Americans call Beasties and we call it Beast Wars or the opposite, but I think ours is Beast Wars, Americans is Beasties. Um, reasonable condition, a little bend on that, but it's, it's nothing at all. It's just proof of purchase, um, but pretty good clamshell, and I'm happy to see a feature length Beasties adventure. A whole hour and 40 minutes, so that'll be a beastific time. It'll be interesting, I hope. Anyways, Thank you for watching my thrift store haul video. I'm going to start a uh, series called The Shelf. And what I do is instead of just organizing all my movies alph alphabetically, I put them into the categories and rate them top to bottom. Top shelf is the best stuff, bottom shelf is the worst. And then of course there's the Tower of Despair, which is the worst of the worst. Anyways, I'm just learning how to do all this YouTube stuff. So encourage me and I'll get more coming. Thanks for shopping with me. Bye guys.